What's up everyone? Uh, we're gonna do a little different video today. I got a Model O for Christmas and the mouse wheel started squeaking like immediately and I forgot to submit anything to customer service. Like I just kept forgetting and forgetting and then I finally did it. They sent me the stuff to fix it and I still forgot to do it. So we're finally gonna do it right here and I'm gonna show you guys how to do it if you have this issue as well. So first what you need is you need uh, replacement feet for your mouse. So you can see I have almost all mine removed already. The two important ones, I just didn't remove that one yet. You need some mouse like switch lube. So Gloria sent this out to me. You need a screwdriver to take the screws out and then you also need something to apply the lube. So I just have these little paint brushes to do the trick. So to start, you wanna remove the mouse feet, kinda like I said, and then you wanna screw out the two little screws right here so you can see them there. Then you're going to peel the mouse apart so you can see right here that it's coming apart, you take that off. So now that you have it apart, there's still another screw you have to take off. So you just have to be careful to not like rip this off and ruin it. Now that you have the bottom screw off, you wanna move it and take this screw off as well. Now you just move that piece to the side and you lift this up and it comes right off of here. So first I'm gonna lube this spot right here. So now that those two spots are lubed where like the wheel comes in contact, you're just gonna pull this wheel right out pretty easy. So now that you have this open, there's two spots that you're gonna wanna lube. So you're gonna wanna do that little green circle and then also this green like thing that's up to the left because those are both in contact with the mouse. So just put a little bit of lube in both of those spots. So now that you've lubed the housing or the PCB or whatever it is, now you're gonna lube just the little end pieces of the wheel on these two sides since that's like what's in contact. So now you've officially lubed like the whole mouse so you wanna put it back together and get it squared away. All right, so you just have to make sure you put all the screws in the right spot, put it back together, and then you will have to put the mouse feet on. But I am gonna wait and test out the wheel a little bit because I don't want to put it back on and put my new ones on just for me to have to take it apart again, so.